the hell was that? What do you mean? I mean calling out Shawn Michaels on your first day. There are unwritten rules to follow here. There's a system in place. Who do you think you are to just ignore all that? I think I'm the top prospect now. No, just because you caught an old timer off guard doesn't make you the top anything. That title still belongs to me and everyone here knows it. That's not what Triple H posted on social media. Wait, what did he say? Man, it sure is easy to get in your head. I'll keep that in mind going forward. Just so you know, I'm not cool with how you acted on your first day. Challenging Shawn Michaels might have worked out, but it isn't how we do things around here. So I'm not trying to be cute or anything, but you're in my doghouse. Let me save you some time. If you're looking for some kind of apology or for me to admit I was wrong, it's not going to happen. Fine. If I can't talk some sense into you, then maybe I can get through to you in the ring. Are you saying you want me in a match? Damn straight. You and me today, one on one. I don't know what you think you're going to accomplish, but I'm going to beat another Hall of Famer. And if you ain't down with that, I got two words for you. Too bad. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from England. Weighing in at 248 pounds, Jay.
So, you beat me on day one, albeit under questionable circumstances. But do you think you can take down two Hall of Famers in a tag match? Are the Bushwhackers in town? Funny. I mean, how about you team up with anyone here and face me in Road Dog? If beating you two helps me get more recognition, then I'll do it. All right. Figure out who you want to team with, and we'll see you in the ring. I already know. I'll team with Chase and still beat you two.
Hey, we have some good news. You're not going to have to deal with us much longer. Well, maybe if everything works out. What do you mean? Triple H feels like he's seen enough from you and the rest of the class. So it's time for an official evaluation. Is this the PC showcase you mentioned back on my first day? Exactly. All of the GMs will be here to see you guys in action. If you impress any of them enough, you might receive a contract offer. It's about time. I was ready for this after I beat you day one. I understand the urgency, but some guys never get this kind of opportunity. Don't take it for granted. Don't worry. I'll make the most of it. We have the matches for the showcase lined up. Paragon is facing Hector, and you'll be going up against Chase. And don't repeat this, but that should set you up to look good in front of the GMs. Yeah, about that road dog. See, I was thinking about his first day. Oh no, it's never good when you're thinking. I know, I know. I was thinking about how he called me out and beat me. It was definitely a statement win for sure. But what I'm getting at is, how about instead of taking another shortcut at the showcase, you face me again instead. You beat me once when I wasn't prepared. Can you do it again in a high stakes situation? This time, when I'm ready. Just think about this for a second, okay? A win over HBK could open a lot of doors. That's no easy task. Chase is the safer bet, but, but definitely wouldn't impress the GMs as much. I'd be happy to beat you again. Good. But technically, you have to beat me again twice. It's going to be a two out of three falls match. That's great and all, guys. But now I need to find a new opponent for Chase, and that's going to turn into a whole thing. Not that that's your problem. Anyway, before I forget, the GMs want the full presentation for the showcase, so you're going to get to wear the gear you designed a while back. Good luck. Yeah, good luck, kid. Just a heads up, I wouldn't get all worked up about this PC showcase, since the GMs are really only coming to scout me. That's funny, because I think they're actually showing up to see me. Who are you even facing anyway? I heard Shawn Michaels? Yeah. I'm going to beat them again, and show the GMs what they've been missing out on. Are you an idiot? You had the chance to face Chase, which would have been a walk in the park and a guaranteed contract offer. But instead you chose to face a motivated Mr. WrestleMania, who's out for revenge? A win over HBK will punch my ticket to anywhere I want to go in WWE. Yeah, and a loss will do nothing. Well... That's why I'm not going to lose.
I've heard a lot about you. I look forward to dominating NXT and using it as a stepping stone to bigger things. A bit pompous, are you? I have a feeling you might be singing a different tune after you see what NXT is all about. In fact, with that attitude, you might become the stone that gets stepped on. I look forward to proving you wrong. <laughs>